Hi, Zweetians. Welcome back to Zweetieville. If you're new to my channel, welcome to Zweetieville. I am Zweetie Pie, and we are back with another exciting episode of, yeah, you guessed it, the Not So Berry Challenge. I am having NSB withdrawals, let me tell you. So I turned it in, I loaded it up. I was going to wait till everybody got up in the morning before I started this, but then I got this, and Fatima has aged up. Seniority, wrinkled bellies, frothy locks, and intermittable naps await. Party like the Reaper's not around the corner. So, all right. She is now getting a little older. They're all going to bed. Obviously, I have a ghost running around or something. No. Fatima is up. Honey bud, just go to sleep. Get off the computer. You're fine. Yes, I know. You're old. All right. So, I have a ghost now, so it's not, like, really going to work in fast-forward mode. Is that what you're telling me, computer? Yeah, it's kind of slower. All right, so, I know we did the positivity challenge, so if you followed my channel, oh, thanks, um, you would see that, you know, we have done that, but it obviously doesn't unlock all the posters. Once you do that for every family, it's just literally for that family. Which kind of really sucks because I wanted those posters like unlocked, unlocked. So, <sighs> yeah. So, I guess for the NSB here, we are going to do it again because, you know, it literally didn't take me anything but like three episodes. And I was like trying to stretch it a little bit. So, like, I'm pretty sure we can get it within the four days and 22 hours that you see on the screen that we still have of the positivity challenge. So, um... We'll give somebody that aspiration. It sure can't be our founder. Um, okay, it's 6.41 in the morning on a Tuesday. All right, let's chillax a second, child. Um, you need to use and take a shower for school. And then I need you to come down here. Oh, wow, this is so much more vibrant with this reshaded. Ooh, wow, that yellow pop. Um, there we go. And then as soon as she gets out of the bathroom, we will wake him up. Um, I, we can change his aspiration for a little bit. It's really not going to matter because I'd really like the founder to get them so we can pass them down in the NSB because, you know, they have emotional auroras and stuff, and I kind of want to be able to benefit that as much as we can, you know? There is nothing wrong with that. Yeah, like, girl, you really don't need it. Um, but you do. Take a brisk shower. Presents tomorrow. From anticipating open presents. Yay, tomorrow Grayson is going to get present. What a wonderful day it will be. What? It's tomorrow, Chris. Oh, it's Winterfest tomorrow. And then we have a season premiere. Okay. So, um, yeah, okay. That That's kind of cool that he's, like, got a buff for it. All right. It's probably because he's a kid. Um, there we go. Can you come and, um, get leftovers, dude, now? You're good. Did you eat, child? Can you come and, um, surf the TV while you do that to get fun? Um, let's do that and use the bathroom. So he should be good. I have auto lights on, don't I? Auto lights, all ah, lights. Oh no. Turn on all lights. Why? 
this so dark in this area? Oh my goodness. All these windows and everything. All these rooms are so bright, but this one. So irritating. Alright, dude, you're good. You're good. You guys are getting ready to go to school. Oh, oh okay. Um, she's going to troll the forums. Do you work today? Yes, yes you do. You got everything complete. You need to go to work and... Are we at the... No, we're only a Ugh. I am not doing very good on getting her career done. Um... What does she need to... Like... What mood? The best ways to improve her purpose are going to work and... With a positive emotion, completing the daily tasks, and maintaining a high relationship. Uh, well, I mean, she's pretty positive. She's brightly green. She's doing good. Alright, go to school. Go to school. Have fun. Alright, girl. Can you come and um, get leftovers? Can you come and get leftovers as well? Thank you. Nice work, Grayson. Completing school projects really has a positive impact on your parades. Keep up the great work. Um, everyone's off to school. Layson, um, Leiden did hers. And so she is doing well as well. Good. Is he an A student? He's a B student. So I have him study hard right now. He should get it in no time. But, you know, just in case, she's an A student. Um, she can study hard. Go ahead, y'all. It's okay. <laughs> Come get leftovers. I, I already said that. Wow. Ooh, um, work hard. Because, you know, we can, and we're going to. Ooh, oh, like, she's literally going to take her food in here and eat. You're disgusting. <laughs> I do not see this. <laughs> nor do I condone it. Ugh. But, I mean, she's multitasking before work. I mean, I can't complain about that. Alright. That should be our gardeners all done. Winter Fest starts tomorrow. Yes, yes, we know. We are well, well aware of that. Okay, what are you doing? Um, can you not? Um, sick with worry it's test day and Leiden is so nervous she totally blanks even copying her neighbor won't work because her neighbor is a D student what to do feign illness or just take deep breaths take deep breaths honey no so come Pack into a sack lunch. Come put away. Um, Layden tries to squeal her anxiety by taking deep, big breaths. And what do you know it at work? Sure, her classmates shoot her some funny looks. But when you're an A student, you take every test seriously. Average out. Grayson's last math test was not his best work. He got a so-so grade, which could really bring down his average. Should he ask to do some extra credit work or just try hard to get a perfect grade next time. Ask for some extra credit. 
The teacher decides to provide Grayson with a little life lesson. Isn't it great when they do that? Grayson learns that if he wants a better grade, he should study harder first instead of crying about it after. Oh, did you just knock him down? No. Okay. I was going to say, mm-mm. All right, you're good. Go to work. You're, like, extremely late. Hopefully, they don't knock your performance because we can't really deal with that. But, okay. Um... Put away. Oh, yeah. Da da da. Achieve level 10. Evolve 10 excellent pants. Work hard. Okay, let's see. Um, harvest all. So she should start harvesting everything. And we got rid of everything that's not a flower. So we don't have to worry about any of that. Oh, those darn gnomes. <laughs> Harvest all. Harvest all. You gotta come back over here. Ooh, the mill's here. Okay. Are there any plants sparkling? I don't see anything sparkling. Oh my goodness. Look at those bills. Woo, baby. My gosh, they ain't my real bills in life. I would have an absolute fit. Um... Let's see. Take a cutting. A research. Research. Take a cutting. Research. Uh, graft. There you go. Can you take a cutting of that one? Um, research. What the flip is that little thing? It's a spliced plant. Oh. Cool, cool. Alright, well, she's going to be busy a while. It's going up. It's going up. So she's really happy. All right. How are you doing? You're doing good. Let's see. Life lesson. Hmm. She's doing good. Okay. Just stay energized, dude. Oh. No, no. Stay. <laughs> Feeling fresh. She's got two more hours of that, hopefully. Hopefully continues. Is it literally raining? Yeah. It's like raining on her. Oh, okay, cool. And updated the notebook, okay. Girl, that was, like, wasteful. Alright, we're gonna speed through this because, like, this is boring. Like, we're just waiting for someone to get home from work or... Like, literally something. Congratulations on your recent birthday. Oh, she's sad because we forgot her birthday. I'm sorry. I, I just haven't played in a while. My bad. I probably would have done better, but, you know. Oh, oh, look at that performance go up. And then she works the next two days. So hopefully by the end of this week, we can get her up. Um, and promoting her would be really, really nice.
Any fertilize that with um, one of those. And then harvest all of those. And um, fertilize with uh, one of those. And take a cutting there. And uh, research some here. There we go. We're, we're keeping her busy. Oh, okay. Let's see. She's doing just fine. Let's um, make connections. All right. He's home. Layden has returned from school. She's one of the top students of Layden. Grab up from the lunch tree. Keep up the great work. Celeste has researched apple tree and updated the notebook. All right, and he made it home. Let's see. Good grades, all right. Stressed from school, too much studying. Yeah, dude, I feel you. Um, but he's an A student, he made it. He did a great job. So, you know, he's talking to his little sister. They're so cute. Oh, here, we gotta do this real quick. Um, New aspiration. This way? Oh, no, we gotta call her over. That's what we gotta do. Alright, let's, um... Call the event coordinator. Yaba! Wait, Miss Barambo! Yaba! So what a baby! Enthused about interest. Oh no. Come talk to your little sister. Give her a pep talk. Tell her it's okay. Ooh, a team. Wow. Just walk it on the street. Oh, you know her. Call her over. Now move into Wallach, huh? Masha. Alright, girl, what do you need? Go do that, then that, then that, then that. Bye bye. Where's this event coordinator? There you are. There you are, yep. Go ask. Um, more actions. Ads group. There we go. Alright, there you go. Go, go hunt her down. I need you to change. Um, can you go do something? Okay, I'm just gonna follow you. You'll know where she is. It looks like she just went in our house. Reba. Nope, she's at the back door. Villabot? Ah, Kangaroo! Vima! <laughs> Oh. All right. Um, so it says, okay. hi there, succeeding okay. in the positivity. Oh, I turned down voices, but evidently not enough. Um, audio. Voices. Go down. There we go. Apply. So it says, in case you didn't watch the positivity challenge, we'll go through it with this one here. Hi there, succeeding in the positivity challenge requires you to perform an assortment of kind, generous, and sweet tasks for other Sims. Be friendly towards other Sims or perform helpful deeds for your neighbors. Anything that spreads positive energy. After completing a stage of the aspiration, be sure to open the box of kindness to receive an award. All right, and then you gotta click on her and issue. Uh, Zimbabwe. Uh, 
All right, and then congratulations, Grayson has unlocked the Hidden Positivity Challenge Aspiration. It can be found with the other challenge aspirations. You click to change it, and Challenge Positivity. There we go. So he has changed that. Um, Aurelia is home. She did some great work. Oh, on the road to fame. I haven't got this yet. Sims have now the ability to become celebrities. There are many different ways to become a celebrity. And as your Sims progress in their skills and careers, more paths to stardom will become available. Some great ways to become famous include pursuing a career in acting or raising the media production skill via the video station or music station objects. Look for interactions labeled with the plus star fame. Each of these will contribute towards becoming a superstar. Oh, okay, cool. They've not given me that yet since I've been playing. All right, so we got the positivity challenge. We have the presents. Um, let's move them in the house over here in the corner. No. There we go. We'll, we'll just put them right there. That works for me because it's like the only corner we have open. So we're good. And do, 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 what am I doing? I lost my train of thought. Oh, oh, that's what I'm going to do. So here, open, more, open. Two pancakes left. They got lots of turkey dinner. One of those. Six of these. So we're going to do this one. And um, call the meal. Oh, before we do that, let's check in with Aurelia here because she is home. Let's have her um, change her outfit. Uh, what did I flip? It? There it is, right in front of me. And it's kind of cold, so can you do that one? All right. Thank you very much. I'm going to have you come here, get the mail, pay the bills. Let's check on your progress. Yep, you moved up quite a bit. So we're going to have you do that. I'm going to have you go out on your space mission. Whoa, not what I wanted. Um, wow, that gets you fame points. Wow, ha, ha, ha. Okay, good to know. That's why I got that message. Okay, you go do that. Go get famous by, you know, being a famous astronaut. Sweet, sweet. We're going to get rid of this for you and collect some moolah. All right, there we go. And this should bring that one girl that he grouped up with in so that he can talk with her. And let's see here. More friendly. Well, that didn't do any good. So how about he, um, more funny, funny story. Let's get this going. Um, obsess about social media. Oh my goodness. More friendly. Let's see. There's usually one up under here, like bright and day or something. Maybe we gotta give it a minute. Is that teenager gonna come? Is that you? No. Gosh darn it. 
Lost in space, Aurelia is gliding through the galaxy when she notices a constellation she has never seen before. Double-checking her coordinates, Aurelia realizes she is not where she thought at all. What's more, her ship's GPS, Galactic Positioning System, has gone black. She is lost in space. So, keep calm, Aurelia. Yep, she left. So... I guess he's gonna have to complete this with his family. Let's um, throw that in there then. My bad. So, let's in. Okay, let's have this come up. A treasure map, trying not to panic. Aurelia scans the horizon for familiar stars. There, a flashlight. She zooms closer only to discover a mysterious glass container with what looks like a message beacon inside oh my gosh extracting it aurelia finds a map with an x marked on a planet near the constellation's head it's almost too good to be trusted what now ah, follow the map we're adventurous why not all right let's get little sis here fire her up ask her about her day The tunnel. Sure enough, the map leads Aurelia to a charred-looking planet with a lone tree growing from a cliff. At first glance, the plant seems abandoned, but then she notices the opening of a small tunnel beneath the tree. Go in? Yeah! Good luck. This door to play. Um... Tell her a funny story. Aurelia's been seen. Aurelia calls out. No answer. The only sound is a soft dripping. She treads quietly into the tunnel, but suddenly everything goes black. She whirls, flipping on her trusty headlamp, eyes glowing in the narrow beam. Not two, but hundreds. Aurelia can try to talk her way out of this or run like crazy. Ah, she's good with aliens. Talk to them. Aurelia always has been a good talker, and lies are easier when they contain a smidgen of truth. Explaining about the broken GPS, she leads the spider-like creatures toward her rocky ship. Sure enough, the screen is black. Muttering, an alien technician climbs aboard and slams it three times. Magic, Aurelia enters her home coordinates and clears out fast. See, she's good. She can do this alien thing in my bobber. She has got the life. Um, so there we go. So we performed a good deed. Um, we need to meet a new sim. So let him talk here. I'm sure someone is outside here. Who are you? You're a celebrity. That'll be too hard. You're an adult. An adult. You're a celebrity. You're a kid. Adult. 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 <laughs> adult. We're adulting. I don't want to adult today. You can't make me. Um, can we just go meet the neighbors? Anyone here? Oh, no one lives there. Cool. Here? Nope, no one lives there. Oh, no one's home. They live there. And no one lives there. Um, no one is home. Okay, well, that was kind of like a good idea until I just hacked it. You know, it doesn't matter because all of these people are flipping adults. So, we'll wait till he's done. I'll have him come outside. 
And the first person closest to him he is going to talk to. Because <laughs> that is how we are going to play this. Alright, so are you doing good now? Yeah, you are. So can you do your homework, young lady? Who are you? Um, give my friendly introduction. Hey, there's a teen. Someone your age. Thank goodness. Your homework's complete. All right. Do your extra credit. All right. Hit bump. All right. How's he doing? All right. Perform five good deeds now. So we've done one. Let's see. Is there any more in here? Ask him about his day. He's very angry. Oh, oh. Ask him about his career. Try to calm him down. Discuss interest. Alright, well. Okay, he's fine now. A balanced meal. Someone said eating dirt was okay, but someone else said eating dirt will make you die. Is it okay to eat dirt or not? Um, both of them affects manners. Eating dirt is really unhealthy. If you do, kids may tease you. Yeah. You know, you might get teased. <laughs> You're big. Zersa anar bambufa. Um, enthuse about interest. Let's see if we can get his mood changed. No, we changed his mood, so, you know, that should, like, be a good deed. Tell him a funny story. Dude. No. Well, fine. Where's your family? Mom's up here. Alright. Come talk to mom. And, um, tell her a funny story. And then can you come tell this mom a funny story? And sis is here. So, when you're done, can you come and... Tell her a funny story. She's already in bed. But she's okay. We'll have her get up and just go wherever the sister's going. Just come sit here. Just go here. This milk. Come play. There we go. We'll just have them all come in here. Make it faster and easier on him. He's like, hey. Um. Friendly. Anything in here? Let's, um, just tell her a funny story. Hey, girl, can you come back in here and sit? Thanks. 
Why don't you sit and join game? Oh wow, that was a glitch. All right, how you doing, dude? Is it counting? All right, come on. Um, no, it's not working. So let's see. There was one under friendly when I was in my other game, but it might not be popping up. Well, it's not, it might not be popping up. It's like literally just not popping up. So he needs to do his homework and everything. Do your homework. Um, go use. Um, do your extra credit. And, we'll see. He only got two. That was so bad. Oh, hey, hey, stop. I want Grayson to do that, please. Just put it down. Please, put it down. Just stop. Yeah, here. Go way over here. There. Just go away. <laughs> Clean up. Clean up. Okay. Let's see if this is considered a good deed. Um, let's don't. We'll find out. Doesn't bother me any. Let's see. Okay. Why don't you use and take a speedy shower and go to sleep. The night needs to be ending here soon. So, you know, do that thing. And we'll find out if this counts. Can you get up and how about you repair that? Did it work? Uh, no. Mop like mad? Will that work? Is that a good deed? Are you being helpful? Nope, didn't work. Well. Sister in there yet? Nope. Oh, the hamster, hamper is full. Maybe that's a good deed. Search pockets, do laundry, add to washing machine. Uh, let's just not search the pockets. We're rich enough. Scavenge for parts and then throw away. And then... There you go. Oh, you're going to go grab all the clothes. Okay. Maybe this is a good deed. Wow. There's clothes everywhere. 
I mean, a teenager doing laundry to me is a good deed. If that is not a good deed to anyone else, I don't know. Because I would be stoked if my teens did some flipping laundry. Because all I do is their laundry because all they do is ever change. And then I get stuck with having to deal with it all. So, I know I would be stoked. Wash laundry. Is that a good deed? Nope. Alright, well, we're ending it. We'll get it done. We have time, so, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna send them off to bed, get them all sleeping and everything, and uh, we'll pick back up in the next episode. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this not so berry um and it was a little different for you and leave me any comments down below that you may have that you would like to see coming up um we need to get grayson his first girlfriend for it to fail um we all know that's gonna happen so if you have an idea let me know so until next time all y'all have a sweet delicious day bye <laughs>